Hi hey everyone, DJ Kidman here, aka Cake Hopper from the Kingdom Home Forums, doing my next toy review, the X King Razor. Size wise, kind of small, but you, it's to be expected with toy swords from uh, Tokusatsu series. Uh, the main feature of this toy, automatic card feeder. Um, you just put place a card in, and once you feel a little tension, it'll uh, once you feel it stop, it'll just roll right through with an automatic card feeder. Requires a little more battery power, but that's fine. Only issue with that little gimmick is that if you try and stick anything in there that's not the same size and thickness as a Rouse card, such as my fake cards that I've shown on my other reviews, it can get jammed. And this thing can be pretty sensitive sometimes. If it gets jammed, you just pop off the plate here. There's a little hole where the uh, card feeder is, uh, where the wheel is for the card feeder. And then you, just, you can just slide the card right through. No biggie. Uh, what also came with the uh, King Rouser was the faceplate for the uh, Rouse Absorber, the King faceplate. Um, and the faceplate is basically what tells the Rouse Absorber uh, what sounds to make when the, when the card is swiped afterwards. Uh, so you can swipe anything after putting in the King uh, plate on the Rouse Absorber and it will do the noises for uh, Evolution King. Um, which I guess is okay. I mean, you can't really expect much from the Rouse Absorber. It's small, and it, it, it does what it's intended to do, which is a, it's a role-play item. Um, um, also has the uh, little thing here, a um, little knob, which hooks it up to the um, the uh, DX tension belt from Comrade Blade. So it just hooks right in, and it will be dangling from the belt like that. The, uh, the thing with the... Um, the King Rouser is instead of actually saying the names of the cards, uh, as far as Thunder and Cake and whatnot, it says the suit and the number, which will say Spade 10, Spade 9, etc. It doesn't do the same thing with other, um, with other suits. It will just say Club Card or uh, Dia Card or Diamonds. I don't have the Chalice Rouser, so I don't have any of those official cards. Um, which means I can't do things like four pair and whatnot. Um, but otherwise, the thing can do every any single poker combo you can think of. It can pretty much do it probably. Um, I, I, I've tested out all the ones I can with the three sheets that I have, and it's able to do every single one. So I'll go ahead and turn it on, and uh, I'll show you what this uh, toy can do. Uh, there's no A or B mode. It's just an on switch because all you're doing is feeding cards and. Uh, there's no counter or anything. When you press the trigger, it makes a nice little slash sound. And uh, the LED lights here light up. Holding down the trigger doesn't do anything. Um, it just pressing the trigger makes a slash sound. So I'll go ahead and start doing combos. First combo in the F popular Royal Straight Plus. I do have to say, this uh, Rouser comes with all the cards from the Blade Suit in gold form which have different barcodes from the regular uh, Rouser, uh, Blade Rouser cards, which, as I explained in the Blade Rouser review, they can't rouse in the Blade Rouser at all, if they miss. Uh, but these make specific sounds for the um, King Rouser. For instance, if I were to take... Um, let's do Spade 2, Slash. It says spade two. If I take the original spade two slash from the blade rouser, it says spade card, just like the other one. I didn't notice that noise that um, the noise it made, it made there. It made the regular Blade Rouser noise, um, which is the, um, the the Blade Rouser slash noise, which I didn't notice before, but that's kind of cool that it does that. I mean, it's programmed with a lot of other sounds. So getting back to it, starting off with Royal Straight Flush. Oh, that's odd. It didn't make the sound. Uh, let's try it again. I probably 
kind of screwed it up a bit by putting in the two uh, spade cards earlier. So let's try the combo again. It's also possible that I didn't put the cards in too fast before, so... And then it said roll straight flush, I just press the trigger and it makes it sound. It makes that same sound for any poker combo that you do. So if I were to do... Alright, if I were to do a flush, which is spade 2, spade 4, spade 6, and then 9 and 10. We have to put in the little card holder thing. Don't want my cards dropping out. Yeah, it's very important that you have this closed when you're feeding cards in, because otherwise the cards will just fly out. And that's it getting jammed, like I mentioned before. Which, like I said, you just take the wheel, and you can roll the wheel out and you can try it again. And out the flush. Um, I can go through pretty much all the poker combos uh, if you want me to, I'll do one more, which is will involve other suits. Uh, wizard and fire and thunder. All right, so I'm gonna do a uh, three cards. I made that sound from the uh, previous combo. I'm gonna take. Blizzard, which is six of clubs. Fire. Thunder. Those were all sixes. Oh, went a little fast there. Um, let me do that again real quick for you guys. Four card, um, a straight, a flush like I meant, like I said before, uh, royal flush, royal straight. I don't know if there's a difference. Um, oh well, it depends on the suit that you put in. Uh, let's see, what else could you do? You do high card probably one pair, four is two pair. Um, actually, let's see if I can do high card real quick. Ten eight. Well, you guys get the idea. It can do all the poker noises, all the poker combos, and it can do sounds for that. And it also has sounds for, for the regular rouse cards, that the same sound that when you rouse it in the other rousers for those suits. So uh, that's the King Rouser in a nutshell. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed the review. Hope it was helpful. If you have any comments, uh, any criticism, please let me know. I enjoy feedback. Uh, flaming, trolling, and spam will be deleted. So uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next one.